Okay, in episode three of Squid Games, I'm like, <laughs> that private eye, whoa, he's actually like, kind of like a hero right now. I think he's like, it's pretty crazy. I'm like really excited to see where he, where this character is going. Um, we did see like a little bit more of those people in red. Like we saw like there's actually multiple roles they have. And like they're not actually pretty free themselves because it looks like they were in like um, almost like a prison. So I'm like, I wonder what they did and why they're there and helping with this game. And oh, the game they played was like um, in this episode was like they ha I have something I've never heard of folks called honeycomb. And it was very interesting. And I really actually want to bake the honeycomb. So stay tuned for that. I'm going to try and get the recipe and make some. And see if we can play some games with that. But um, what I thought was very interesting about this episode is that, like, um, we saw, like, the people in red, like, have personalities that they can talk between each other. That some are breaking the rules. There's corruption within the game. And, like, one of the players actually is, like, helping these people. It's very strange, but like I'm really excited to see what the next game is going to be because these games are getting more and more intense, and I'm a little bit scared for all the characters. 